The clock rate of a CPU of a modern personal computer is usually expressed in. Now clock rate, if you say the clock rate, clock rate is uh, the same with the speed. Right? There is a small difference but still uh, both are same quantities. Quantification happens in the same quantities. See, if you are saying about a modern computer, by the question is given. This is 2007. Okay, so you need to understand this modern means it is 2007 environment. Okay, so according to that, uh, even now the same unit is used. Right? Because why am I emphasizing the term modern? Because if they give the term modern, be very careful. They are talking about current time period. So you need to have a little understanding about how the computer field works right now. Understood? So nicely, even in 2007 and even now, we are in 2019, uh, the same units are used in the modern environment. Okay? Yeah, that's nice. But that, that's a hack of time, we are talking about uh, how many years? 12 years. Yeah? So after 12 years, things can change. So when they utter the word modern, be very careful. Okay? That's what I am emphasizing. So, uh, usually, if you need to measure the speed of a computer, you are using this uh, unit called Hertz. Now, there is a definition for Hertz. Hertz means, if the computer is capable of doing one instruction within a second, we are saying one hertz. If the computer is capable of doing 10 instructions within a second, we are saying 10 hertz. Understood? If the computer is capable of doing 1000 instructions within a second, we are saying 1000 hertz. But you can understand using hertz is really, really uncomfortable in the modern world because we have some computers which are doing millions of hertz. Yes? So we have some alternatives. We are saying uh, 1000 hertz as 1 Hello? 1000 hertz as 1 kilohertz. Okay? And if you have 1000 kilohertz, you are saying 1 megahertz. Okay, if you have 1000 megahertz, you are like 1 gigahertz. After gigahertz, what you are getting is terahertz, but we are not still there. So, in the modern world, we are using this to measure the speed of the computer. So, the first answer says uh, gigahertz, that's the correct answer. Second answer says uh, megabits per second. That is used to measure the speed of networks, data transmissions. Okay. Next one, gigabytes. Gigabytes is a measure for storage. IPS, instructions per second. We use this for a certain extent in the history. Like until uh, second generation ends, we use IPS. Okay. First generation computers, it was 50,000 IPS to 150,000 IPS. In the second generation, it was 200,000 IPS to 250,000 IPS. At the latter part of the second generation, they understood IPS number is going to elevate more than 250,000 and that's really, really uncomfortable. We need some other definition. Understood? That's really, really uncomfortable. So that's why they are defining Hertz. Okay? They are using Hertz to do it. Okay? So, here, your answer should be gigahertz. First answer. 